Or if someone wants to be gay, just, just let them be. It's the same thing surrounding race, I would say. I mean, there's nothing anyone can do about it. There are a lot of, we see things differently, but it's just for everyone to live in peace and not try to hold grudges towards each other. I grew up in Lagos, Nigeria. I was born in Lagos, and I lived there until when I was 23, when I moved here to study. I don't think my family ever knew I was gay, but until now, my father definitely doesn't, but my mom knows. While I was here to study, I went back home for my thesis research, and um, a, tie, a day to the time I was supposed to return to Belgium, I was um, arrested by the police and they s um, went through my phone and they saw um, to them incriminating evidence because it's illegal to be gay and um, they locked me up but I was, I was out after some time. So that's how my mother found out because she came to bail me out. I do enjoy the, the, the gay life in Belgium. I think it's, it's quite fun but at the same time at the same time, it's, it's, it's a little bit small and um, not as open, not as open-minded. So I like to um, enjoy or benefit from the gay scene in other places, like in Brussels or in the Netherlands. Or the most beautiful moment in general, like let's say within a year or two, is when I um, started to explore my sexuality. Because while I was back home, I never did. And when I started to explore my sexuality, that was the most beautiful moment because I was free and I could discover really who I really am. As an empath, I can relate to people who don't understand um, gay people or who don't understand the concept of one man liking another because it's difficult for you to experience or to understand what another person's experience. But I think what we have to do as human beings is to just, um, is to just, accept, just accept each other. If someone wants to be gay, just, just let them be. It's the same thing surrounding race, I would say. I mean, there's nothing anyone can do about it. There are a lot of, we see things differently, but it's just for everyone to live in peace and not try to hold grudges towards each other. I think love is a beautiful thing. I mean, I would really love to um, experience love, but I've never had the opportunity to really do so. So, I mean, that was one of the reasons why I was so confident and happy to stay in Belgium, because I was like, I can now be myself and I would really like to experience love. So um, I'm still hoping that one day I would, um, one day soon I would find love.